Oprah Winfrey. What does Oprah Winfrey mean to me? <laughs> the personification of love. I remember the first time that I was on the Oprah Winfrey show, I quoted uh, Second Corinthians. Mm -hmm. So as opposed to saying love is patient, say I am patient. Iyanla is patient. Oprah is patient. I am kind. Oprah is kind. Iyanla is kind. Carol is kind. Bob is kind. And what we do is we grow that experience within ourselves. So somebody showing up in your life has to, first of all, treat you the way you are and treat you the way you treat yourself. Because if I'm patient, you can't be unpatient with me. Don't bring your impatience in here, honey, because I know, <laughs> you know, don't bring your arrogance. Don't come in my life trying to have your way because I don't insist on having my way. I am love. Iyamla is love. Oprah is love. And to me, that is who and what Oprah Winfrey is. A human personification of love. She is generous. She is... I know Stedman won't agree with me, but she is kind. <laughs> Let's say kind of intention. <laughs> and tell Stedman I could have a different opinion. She keeps no records of wrongs. You know, I know this woman has not been treated well. She has not been treated well. She kept no record of it. And she continues to be generous with her life, with her time, with her resources as her life unfolds. And there is, people don't see it and know it, but I feel it in my spirit, a level of meekness about Oprah Winfrey. You don't see it because you see her big, strong television personality, but there's a level of humility and meekness in her. She is the personification of love. And I am blessed to be able to call her Miss O, my sister woman friend. Hello, my beloveds. Thank you so much for stopping by our own YouTube channel. I hope the clip you just watched helped you in some way in your own life. Make sure to click the subscribe button so that you never miss out on our most memorable lessons and moments. Take care of yourself. And in the meantime, be blessed.